Welcome to Homelink Training for Genie Garage Doors. Before programming Homelink, make sure the people and objects are out of the way and park your vehicle outside of your garage. We recommend getting a new battery for your garage door remote for more accurate programming. If your garage door opener uses rolling code, you may need a step ladder or other sturdy safe device to reach the learn or smart button later in programming. Before beginning training, make sure that your garage door remote is in the correct mode. Press and hold the top button on your garage door remote for 10 seconds until the red and green LEDs both come on and stay on. Press the same button twice to toggle IntelliCode selection from IntelliCode 2, which is green, to IntelliCode 1, which is red. Press the same button one more time and confirm that the LED is only showing red. Your garage door remote is now ready to work with Homelink. Start by clearing your Homelink. To do this, press and hold the outer two Homelink buttons for 10 seconds. Do not release until the indicator light changes from solid to flashing rapidly. Press the Homelink button you would like to train and the Homelink indicator light will begin blinking slowly. Holding your garage door remote one to three inches away, press and hold your garage door remote button. Do not release until the Homelink indicator light changes from flashing slowly to either solid or flashing rapidly. A second person may make the following steps quicker and easier. The next steps are time sensitive and may need to be tried multiple times. On your garage door opener in the garage, locate the learn or smart button. Press and release the learn or smart button and the indicator light will begin blinking. Within 20 seconds, return to your vehicle and press and release the programmed Homelink button. Repeat the press and release sequence up to three times to complete the training process. Homelink should now activate your rolling code equipped device. 